Chaos unfolded this morning along Lee Highway near Brain. News 12's Nick Hill went to the scene and saw how a crash disrupted that area's Valentine's Day. He joins us now live with the details. Nick. Good evening, Emily and Andrew, and happy Valentine's Day to all of you. What certainly was not feeling the love today was a power pole that snapped in half when a U-Haul ran into it, and that collision was only the beginning of a very messy day in the Brainerd area. Well, we were, we were sitting in the office, and uh, you got really startled. It's a loud noise, uh, really loud noise, and uh, apparently that U-Haul ran into a pole. For employees and clients in the Central Office Park complex, they saw a wild scene after hearing a bang outside. Uh, yeah, saw two people come out, a man and a woman, out of that U-Haul, come through the side alley right here. I'm not sure the direction past that, uh, but they took off kind of gathering stuff. Technical police say the driver of the U-Haul lost control heading westbound into the pole along Lee Highway. The witnesses on the ground say the couple inside the U-Haul were frantically trying to get away from the scene. She had a pretty big laceration in the middle of her forehead. Um, she wasn't all the way there. I mean, you could tell that she was shaking up and uh, was looking for belongings in there. Um, it's pretty obvious that they were on something. At the crash scene, I personally witnessed debris on the ground, such as a lamp, bags, and several needles. With the power pole taken out, EPB crews arrived at the scene to begin work quickly on replacing the light pole. An EPB spokesperson told us that 75 customers were left in the dark by the crash. While crews are working on replacing the pole, which EPB says will take multiple hours, Lee Highway from Aikens Drive to Airport Road have been closed. While a scary situation, no one else on the ground was injured, and witnesses to the scene were thankful for that. That was a really loud noise. I'm just glad they didn't go any further. Yeah, it was terrifying. It was yeah. a, a loud boom, and then there's kind of like a pop with it. Yeah. Um, and so it was, um, yeah, it was pretty intense. Chattanooga police say these two individuals have not yet been detained for questioning about the incident. They say charges are pending via their capture and an investigation. No description is available about these suspects outside of the one witness saying that the woman had a laceration on her face. If you're in the Brainerd area and see anything suspicious, do contact Chattanooga police. Reporting live, Nick Hill, News 12.